Unfortunately, Julia Coakley could not find her way out of the thousand mile hallway house, and thus we are joined by Spleens the Cat. Spleens the Cat is an adorable creature, just like Gandalf, he sleeps with his eyes open. And don't hate on my name, what do you want, okay? Every single cat is always named after an object, all right? It's always like mittens or buttons or something like that. What's wrong with Spleens? Oh, here we go. Spleens is awake. Here he is. Spleens, in case you're wondering, is a mixed breed. Uh, I believe it's actually a she. Uh, Spleens is a calico mixed with cocaine. A cocaineco, if you will. Spleens has the paranoid trait, uh, but he has evolved. So his eyes derp out to the sides so much that he is able to see in a 240 degree rotation. His ears also make up about 20% of his entire body mass. Oh, Spleens has decided to join Flavored Bleach. That's nice of her. Hey, Spleens, can you activate this machine over here? Damn it. Come on, Spleens, I need you outside so I can lock the friggin' door. George Washington just became friends with Spleens. Who wouldn't want to be friends with Spleens? Spleens is in the kitchen looking for scraps. She's making a salad, but it's fine. Spleens is actually a vegetarian. Only one creature gets to enjoy the comforts of home. That's Spleens. All right, Florida man, you're allowed inside, but only to feed Spleens. Hey, Spleens, how you doing? You still alive in there, buddy? Yes, yeah, Spleens. No, 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 no. <laughs> Spleens is looking good. I want to let you know, you all have to die before Spleens gets taken away by animal services. See, she's hungry again. <gasps> Spleens is running away. You ungrateful bastard. How you gonna run away now? I just got rid of the friggin' gate. Go ahead and wall this up. Here we go. No one leaves. Not even cats. The best part of this whole endeavor is we still have Spleens. Because he can't run away because I've locked all the friggin' doors. Oh. And Spleens is still here. You see, Spleens is out here, chilling by the pool. I like how Spleens is getting in on this yelling match, too. <laughs> and Spleens is completely unconscious. Again, with his eyes totally open. Spleens is running away. This is, this is the worst day in Sims history. I should have locked the front door. Go, Spleens. Be free, you freak of nature. When you come back, though, I'm locking these doors. You're never getting out again. I've never specifically tried to watch Spleens eat, but when he eats, his eyes go further to the side than normal. This is a defense mechanism. He wants to make sure that no one else is rolling up on his food bowl from either side. <laughs> Spleens has upgraded his attacks now. He's able to shoot multiple hearts at the different owners. I don't even know what half of this means. He's got some sort of, like, double kitten love symbol going on here. It's like an extra cat I don't know about in your life or something, Spleens. No, never mind. The only other thing in Spleens' life is his own tail. Spleens is traumatized at this event. Not because he, he loved her. Because if all the humans die, there'll be no one left to feed him. I like how this child is going absolutely friggin' buck wild. And Spleens is like, you know, that's a pretty good picture, I gotta tell you. Couldn't have done better myself. Also, can someone please feed me? As the dead continue to mount... I would thought I would leave you all with this image right quick. Spleens has decided to give everyone a fantastic look at her crotch. You better start taking this crap seriously, because unless you learn how to open up the refrigerator, once all the humans are dead, you're gonna have a lot of problems. And Spleens is still like, uh, there's only three people left with access to the food. I don't trust the child. Why is it that Spleen sleeps in a more comfortable place than Florida Man? <laughs> Spleens and Tinker Hell are apparently having a very engaging conversation here. What the hell? Spleens is going into labor? What the hell? How? Spleens, how the hell did you get pregnant? Oh, it was the one time you got out. You little hoe. Spleens, I'm very curious. What does your little juvenile cat look like? George Washington, congratulations. For your success, you get to take care of the hideous kittens that Spleen gives birth to. This is one Spleen's the cat. This is two Spleen's the cat. This is five Spleen's the cat. This is 18 Spleen's the cat. Not only do they hate children, but they also hate animals now. And I have decided to clone Spleen's 18 times. But wait, there's more. Spleens now has a potential suitor. 
tonsils. His fertility is off the charts. <laughs> and I want to see if he can impregnate the various other spleenses that are here and how long my sims will last with this many cats in a realm where they hate all things animal. Oh, and apparently I missed two spleens. They're everywhere, man. You have no idea. I have also changed the pregnancy rate of all of the spleens. The spleens can now give birth to up to six kittens per attempt. Apparently one of my spleens also smells like fecal material. That's very unfortunate. Apparently tonsils has obsessions. Guess it makes sense. Oh god, I have to click on all the laziness because Spleens is just a clone of himself. So they're all lazy as hell. You like to dance to music? Very good. Why not do it right next to the freaking pool while your cat goes completely insane? Tonsils, listen, I need you to start impregnating the various Spleenses. It's the only way to get this population completely out of control. I like how all of the spleens are singing to T-Rex simultaneously. They're like, God damn it, listen to the song of our people. Where are you going? Get your ass back here. Damn, that's savage. He straight up took T-Rex's spot. <laughs> this one's just yelling at the statue. She's like, who is this interloper? This poor Sim is in bed just trying to rest and there's like six spleens in here just yelling at him. These two spleens are actually giving it to him from both sides of the bed. Third one just joined in. That's awful. You thought you could sleep on our dime, you bastard. We will meow all night long. Spleens is running away. Which one? There's like 18 of them. That's what you get. I'm seriously insane. You try and stay away from the spleens, your ass is gonna die. You can see there was actually no spleens in here. She managed to go as far away from them as possible. Hey, can you watch out? You're getting your tears all over spleens. Actually, you know what? Keep crying. This is probably the only bath that Spleens has gotten since she's been here. Clearly, we're missing a few more Spleenses. There's like a uh, little procession coming in here of them. God, there's just so many. It's like a friggin' army. I like how all the Spleens are like here. If there's one thing that Spleens loves, it's a full liquor bar. I just went in here like to give the cat a toy for once so it has something to do and my choices are give the ball to spleen spleen spleens all the way down spleens has been tearing this whole area up. oh god this freaking cats never leave either they just laugh at their stupid human owners constantly this whole area by the pool is just a giant pile of feces and clothes Every once in a while, I pause the game and I find Spleens looking his most demonic. This is that time. Florida man is like, I wonder what Spleens is thinking. Spleens is like, I love cocaine. I got bad news, everyone. One of the Spleens had a stroke. Half of his face is constantly drooping now. His eyelid is closed on one side. So, um... Spleens ran away before. Yeah, but uh, he's back now. I gotta see it move. Oh God! <laughs> it's awful. What are you trying to heal her with the power of your love? It's not working. Oh my God, all the pets are going insane. It's like Spleens needs you. Someone needs to feed the goddamn food bowl. Florida man, Jesus, stop crying at all the dead bodies and get over here and help Spleens. They're all starving to death. There's dead bodies. Everyone is dirty and or dying, and all of the cats are sad. Except for this one that keeps throwing hearts at the dead body. As always, the adorable Spleens is on the hunt for delicious cocaine. I like how Spleens is all rolling up in Florida man's business. <laughs> Look at her just standing there. She's like, are you smelling him? That's all. <laughs> God, the scent was enough to make her right eye derp even more to the side than normal. What do you want, Spleens? We you want a litter box? If you need a litter box, why don't you learn how to use the toilet like everyone else? Okay, real quick. <laughs> it's like I pissed her off so much that her eye is about to jettison from her skull. Spleens is running away. It didn't take long. I know she's gonna come back pregnant. Hey, Spleens has returned. Now we can be happy about something. Hey, Spleens. Come on, what are you doing? What is, what is this? Found by a, mis by a faithful companion. I thought it was someone gave you something, Spleens. I thought it was your suitor. <laughs> Spleens is gonna talk about how disparate. Oh, hold on. Open your eyes, Spleens. 
when her ears hang down, she looks even more like a troglodyte alien being sitting at a table filled with rotting hamburgers while, while Spleen's over here shoots her healing love hearts over oh, I forgot my pants. I'm gonna go ahead and leave you guys with sad Spleen. Obviously, Spleen's is here looking for felonies to commit. Hey guys, guess what? Spleen's is awake. You can always tell when Spleen's wakes up because holy Jesus Christ, what happened here? Oh, well, now I guess I know how Spleen's is able to look in like a 240 degree arc. There's nothing between her ears. That is a beautiful song you have, Spleen's. Spleen's has gone into labor. It's about time. Where are you at, Spleen's? This is a magical moment. I need to know what happens. Right now, it, it just kind of looks like she's doing normal Spleen's things. A kitten is born. Spleen's just gave birth to a kitten. Colin's over here eating and Spleen's is like, yes, my child. Good. <laughs> and thus, I will leave you with sad Spleen's, who will show her displeasure for one of the few competent owners finally dying and leaving her with piles of death everywhere. As usual, Spleen's the cat is here, looking from the ground at her dumbass owners, the people who have decided to show up yet again to another mansion given to them for free by Grey. I know, Spleen's. No one's died yet. But just you wait. Spleen's really cared about you. She cared about you so much that her right eye is almost looking at the back of her brain. As usual, Spleen's eyes have refused to see one another anymore, and as such, her gigantic field of vision is able to watch on in horror as her owners slowly bake. I know a lot of people wonder what that discoloration is near the mouth of Tonsils. That's actually the blood of Spleen's old husband. Tonsils is possessive. Very possessive. Oh god, the heat has already given Spleen's a slight stroke. Oh, wait, her medicine kicked in. She's fine now. How you doing there, Spleen's? I can never tell if she's looking at something or if she's just, you know, looking straight ahead. You can never get the jump on Spleen's. This is how she sleeps. Her eyes are effectively separate entities. They have minds of their own. Sometimes I don't know if Spleen's is crying or if she's laughing. Spleens is obviously so happy she can barely contain herself and she didn't get pregnant that this week So I guess that's a bonus Spleens is extra excited today Because this particular video has been sponsored by LG LG the ones that are gonna bring you Spleens and Florida man and super HD more on that later You can see Spleens over there is super excited about them too in 27 inches of QHD I will say though if torturing sims or having a giant Picture of Spleens as your desktop character isn't your thing. Coming at you with a brand new toy review on this squishy that looks a lot like Spleens. Spleens is over here like I've never seen my owner so happy before. It would be a shame if they suddenly died. They're writing jokes and Spleens is like, your jokes are crap. They're so bad, please kill me. Florida man is praising Spleens. I just saw this randomly. <laughs> what do you, what is it? What is he like? I'm so glad that you're, Annoying the hell out of LSD while she sleeps. Yes, good Spleens. Ruin her life with your dutiful gaze. Spleens is probably over here like, Jesus Christ, Gray, what did you do? I've never seen this before. I've never seen tonsils and spleens engaged in mortal combat. It's probably because the rest of the Sims are so busy trying to die still. Spleens is a free spirit. They'll often wander out at night and come back with some surprises. Yeah, I know. Spleen's always come back pregnant. <laughs> His whole life was just, he almost landed on the cat. Colin, no, I swear to God, if you landed on Spleen's, I would have been super unhappy. Even Death is thinking about Spleen's. He's like, don't worry, Spleen's. You're the one character I would never kill. Spleen's is like, no, Death, you don't understand. I'm the one character you can't kill. Spleen's has gone into labor. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is that it? And we finally have a sim give birth to triplets. I'm glad this is good to know that Spleens counts as a, as a sim. All right, Spleens. Let me see what your adorable heathens look like today. This one really takes after Spleens. It looks like her eyes are trying to run away from one another. Where did you come from? You look far too normal. And you, little child of Spleens, 
you also appear to have at least a little bit of dirt. React to cat birth. What do you- how do you react to it? Would you pat her on the back? Good job getting knocked up, Spleens. Oh Christ, Spleen has gone into labor again, no. Real quick, Olna just aged up. She's got the exact same eyes as Spleens. <laughs> Spleens is like, that's my daughter, she takes after me. Spleens is having so many kittens that all the cats in the world are gonna have terrible derp eyes. This also means you have like eight derpy cats that you have to take care of. Spleens is on a leisurely stroll looking for discarded drugs around the property. Oh, this is cool. It's pretty rare, but every once in a while you can catch Spleens immediately after she ingests 400 kilograms of methamphetamine. People will be like, where is she storing it all? It's all in her ears. See how one eye is slightly closed? That's because the, the left half of her over here is actually asleep. The right half is wide awake though. This is a really interesting conversation that Florida Man and Spleens are having. Florida Man is like, I love Bud Light, and Spleens is like, I love having strokes. Spleens is a free spirit. They'll often wander out at night and come back with some surprises. The only surprises that I've seen Spleens come back with is kittens. Spleens has gone into labor, of course she has, god damn it. Whenever Spleens goes into labor and additional kittens end up in the game, it sometimes has a tendency to break things. Meanwhile, Spleens is over here and she's like, man, this yellow water tastes so weird. All the freaking cats are sick now too. <laughs> Spleens is like, I don't know what you're talking about. I feel great. Every once in a while, I pause the game and I find Spleens looking extra majestic. You know how some people are double jointed? Spleens is like that, but only in her eyes. I will say that every time Spleens leaves, she ends up getting pregnant, and I have no doubt that that may occur this time. I don't think that it's Tonsils getting her pregnant, because I honestly don't think that Tonsils can, like, see clear enough to get it in. Yeah, Tonsils and Spleens, you bastards aren't getting out of this either. You want to eat, you gotta do it outside. Yeah, don't mind her. Every once in a while, Spleens likes to yodel at the stairs. Oh god, the demonic possession has finally begun to overtake my cat. Spleens' body is, like, folding in upon itself now. I always love that Spleens looks like she's completely asleep. She's not! Oh, this is cute. Everyone's actually eating together over here at the table. See, it's hot dogs, hot dogs, hot dogs, and cocaine. Hey, Spleens. Are you... Are you gonna come in the house, buddy? What are you doing? Are you just guarding the outside of it? Even Spleens thinks it's cold. Spleens is like, this is some bullshit. Out of all the places Florida Man had to piss, he literally did it right in front of Spleens' food bowl. <laughs> Spleens is over here like, why does it smell like piss in front of my food bowl? I'm gonna leave you with this face. The man family is back and everybody's outside having delicious flame cooked hot dogs. Except for Spleens, who is eagerly awaiting the deaths of her owners. This is like the most magical image of Spleens I've ever taken because she's in like mid jump. She's actually very acrobatic because if you notice, one eye can look straight ahead where she wants to jump and the other eye can make sure that nothing is going to impact her from the side. Say she made it. Spleens also likes to sit in between two different people because if you notice, her eyes are split so wide that she can look at both of them at the same time. This is a really weird scene because Australian man looks like he's judging Spleens and Spleens looks like she deflated. I forgot to mention to everyone, I made Spleens and tonsils vampires as well. I never thought that he would burn like this though. Spleens knows how to stay alive. She just has to stay in this one area of the couch. Although, to be honest, by becoming the laziest cat ever to be found in any of these challenges, she's really replicating the appropriate behavior of a cat. All right, so we're back to the only game where you can build a pool that's so big that it will make you want to die. It's The Sims 4. Meanwhile, Spleens is down here. She's like, yeah, I can do this with one eye behind my back. All right, well, uh, renaming the house just crashed the game again. So you know what? We're just going to leave it like it is. There are so many items in this goddamn house that the game is sitting there like, go ahead, Gray, press the enter button. I dare you. I like that tonsils and spleens are still upstairs, like doing their thing while the Sims are slowly wanting to die downstairs in the basement. I'm actually kind of curious. Sp oh, sweet baby Jesus. I think that spleens has glitched out. I haven't fed her in like a week and a half. Look at her eyes, <laughs> jumbling all over the place. This is awful. Uh, she may be catatonic. I'm not really sure. She may have had a stroke. 
She, she appears to be breathing. Florida man has been stuck inside of this sad little room with spleens since I started. Spleens is like, God damn it, Gray. It smells like Bud Light and felony arrest records in here. Spleens has actually figured out the way to not get tortured like the rest of the Sims. Just like in the thousand mile long swimming pool, she has a tendency to just completely glitch out. But she may be acting. She may be like, if he thinks I'm dead, I don't have to be a part of this. Spleens, tonsils, if you two can make it up here, here you go. Little pet food bowl for him too. I mean, who am I kidding? They're never gonna get up here. See, he thinks he's gonna get away with it, but Spleens is like, I see you. Y'all better recognize. Spleen sees everything. <laughs> this is why Spleen is down here guarding the stairs. Hey Spleens, since I know you can't make it up to the top floor for your food, there's something nutritious right there for you. Look at that face, she's like, you sick bastard. And Spleen is over here sleeping in the middle of it all. Or is she? <laughs> That's right, Florida man, go. Get to the goddamn roof. Because if you die, who will Spleen's feel superior to? I appreciate that LSD is giving Spleen's a bath with her tears. Look at the cat, it's just sleeping under the waterfall of crying. Spleen's just woke up. She's like, what the hell, I'm all wet. Spleen's is the only creature that's mastered the art of going up and down the stairs. Spleen's the cat has her eyes bulging out of her skull. Not because she has hypertension or anything, just because like, instead of having an unusual amount of white blood cells, she has an unusual amount of cocaine blood cells. I like how as they're all walking up the stairs, Spleens is right at the front door to greet them. She's like, how y'all doing? Doing good, huh? Yeah, that's nice. You're all gonna die here. Everyone that comes in always says hi to Spleens before they continue to speak with the rest of the population in here. This guy has a very interesting pattern on his head. It's also possible that Spleens just slapped the hell out of him. I mean, I wouldn't mind if y'all fought to the death for the one single bed. <laughs> Spleens is like, I wouldn't mind that either. People are just crying and or urinating all over Spleens over here. You can see the never ending stream of tears hitting the ground. Spleens is being taken away by the pet care worker. Yeah, good luck trying to get inside the house. They're like, you haven't fed Spleens in forever. And I'm like, look, there's food everywhere. Spleens is running away from me or the pet care worker. I mean, I guess I can give the trophies to these cats over here, including Spleens, which has gotten the zombie plague or something. I like how one of Spleens' eyes is 50% larger than the other. She's like, I can see that gnome eyeing me on the other side of the yard. Spleens, don't go to sleep now. You're gonna miss the- Oh my god. What is this face? She's like, I can see a Florida man's towel. Oh, and I kitten size Spleens and tonsils too, and it's fantastic. Spleens' head just looks like a fuzzy football. I like that the cats are still out here to greet all these kids. Spleens is like, with my eyes, I can see you. And at the same time, I can see you. I'm just checking. Y'all know there's like a like a food and a litter box in there, right? I know that starving is easier than dealing with this episode, but come on. Oh, hey there, Spleens. How you doing, buddy? I heard you passed your drug test on Monday. Good for you. She's like, yeah, I just had Florida man piss for me. Spleens is like, get up. You're going to die. You're going to die. He's like, goodbye, cruel world. Tell Spleens I love her. Spleens is over here all narrow-eyed. She's like, I can feel some pleb talking about me now. So Spleens is over here eating and she's like, man, this tastes vaguely familiar. That's right, Spleens. We didn't let Tim Horton go to waste. This is one of those rare instances where if you look deep into Spleens' eyes, you can actually see the bowels of hell. You may think that Spleens is watching her while she sleeps, but Spleens just wants a front row seat to the death. Anyway, I'll leave you with Spleens out here getting ready to mix up some drinks. You'll be remembered. Not by me, but maybe by Spleens. Spleens is like, I don't remember how to move my eye inward. You want me to remember that guy? Right as I say that, Spleens is a lazy cat. She's so lazy, human names are simply too much work for her. Spleens is like, what has two eyes, no future, and knows only a life of death? It's me. Spleens is running away, god no. She's the only one with any common sense in this episode. Spleens and tonsils are still Spleens and tonsils. I really don't know what else to say about this. Spleens is just over here. She wanted to let y'all know that uh, drugs are bad. I mean, there's a couple of cats that are always staring at your slumber unconscious body as well. Spleens is over here. She's like, oh yeah, I see all the Sims are eating. Oh, good for them. Do you know what I don't have any of? 
food. You can actually tell how hungry Spleens is by how large her left eye gets. Anytime you see a cat's groin airing out, you know it's Spleens catching some Z's. Ah, uh, Florida man's brother is making a beautiful painting of Spleens' ass. Spleens is over here like, I hope he's painting my good side. That is gorgeous. You just need to put Spleens' eyes a little bit farther apart. Like I said, it's a lot like being in prison. I like how the one thing that Tim Horton was afraid of was the fact that Spleens was watching him when he's trying to use the bathroom. I like how Death is still just over here chilling out with my cats. Spleens is busy trying to clean up all the urine with her fur. For some reason, when I saw Spleens here looking for food, I picture Batman's voice when he's asking the Joker where Rachel and Harvey Dent are. It's like, Spleens, why don't you get something to eat? And she's like, where is it? I'm not gonna lie, if I could get this as a reference painting, it would be perfect. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoy this episode of The Sims 4. How do you feel there, Spleens? Spleens is like, it looks like Barbie took a bunch of speed and decided to design a house. I like how one eye is looking straight ahead and the other eye is eyeing this snowman. Do you want to eat the snowman or urinate on the snowman? Because it looks like it's made out of cat litter. What the hell has happened here? Poor Spleens is like, I've never been the same after the accident. What is this? What? What? What are you afraid of? Is it the TV? Is it all the bars? Oh, never mind. Her eyes are back in different directions. She's fine. She's just having a little bit of a seizure. Spleens is over here. She's like, I can guard both staircases at once because her field of vision is like 270 degrees. Poor Spleens. She's over here. She's like, I know you're all dropping like flies, but could someone please feed me? Okay, Spleens is trying to heal Australian man with the power of love. I just heard it. Alright, so we're back to the only game where the person that has the highest possibility of murdering you is your own self. It's The Sims 4. Spleens hasn't eaten in like three days, but it's okay. She lives on a steady diet of methamphetamine. This lady's over here. She's like, what the hell is that? Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this episode of The Sims 4. Till the next time. Spleens has trouble seeing anything directly in front of her because of the directions her eyes face. I think that she thought that this shoe over here was one of her children. Oh, Spleens decided to come in here too. Spleens is over here. She's like, look at all this meat that got the heat. Spleens is like, this is metal as hell, yay! Spleens is being taken away by a pet care worker. No, Spleens! Hey, folks. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Sims 4. However, do you know what my Sims love to do? Do every time I give them everything they could possibly want. They love to die. We've got spleens, we've got tonsils. This thing's much smaller though. This is simultaneously the happiest and the scariest I have ever seen spleens in my life. I don't know if spleens is double jointed or if she was just having convulsions and ended up breaking her leg. I think she's just trying to become friends with Hamo so that she doesn't die. This is spleens after she got done huffing 30 pounds of catnip. She's like, I don't think I'm gonna go into work today. Colino, don't do it. Don't give poor Spleens the plague. This lady is part of the anti-Spleens movement. I hope you die next. She's an imposter LSD. LSD would never berate Spleens in such a way. I think the thing I love about this whole scene the most is how Spleens is sleeping right next to the dead body with her eyes open. It's Flo Kane. She's trying to get rid of herself so she doesn't contaminate the rest of society. Remember the lady that was bad mouthing Spleens? She just died. Spleens is over here sleeping in urine. That's pretty normal, I guess. Spleens is being taken away by a pet care worker. And the disease causes this lady to projectile vomit on everyone around her right before she dies. It looks like the people that had all been infected together are now starting to hit the end phase of the illness. You better not land on my cat when you die. Fall to the right. That was close. All right, so we're back to the only game that simulates the slow descent into insanity as you're stuck inside, unable to do anything, and only seeing the same people every day that you see all the time. It's The Sims 4. I like how everyone goes down and Spleens is like, oh, hell no, I'm not going down there. Spleens, you fool. You should have stayed top size. I can't tell if Spleens is watching this performance or if she's trying to warn everyone. She's like, stop, you morons. Let me give you a litter box, Spleens, right next to the performance. Spleens is like, fuck this, I'm sleeping inside the bathroom. I like how everyone is dying and Spleens is just still over here. She's like, I'm still waiting for Babs's encore. 
nosebleeds and running away. Nosebleeds. Don't you run from this. There's still, there, there'll be more comedy shows. I swear to God. But the loss that hurts the most is Spleens. <laughs> Spleens has returned. This is the most important thing that's happened. It's like she's vomiting up someone's birthday present. Spleens is like, oh yeah, I had your present around here somewhere up here. And as Spleens dies, this lady dies from anger. How could you be angry at Spleens, you heartless bitch? And then folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of The Sims 4. Alright, so we're back to the only game where getting older does not mean you're getting wiser. It just means that you're going to die out of breath. It's The Sims 4. Tell me, Spleens, do you like what I've done with the place? She's like, yes. I love it almost as much as I love cocaine. Both Spleens and Tonsils have realized that they've been locked out since all the Sims have been locked in. And thus, they must fight for dominance to see who is the superior being. Wow, that was the... That was the worst battle I have ever seen in my entire life. I think that the problem is because Spleen's eyes turn outward and Tonsil's eyes turn inward, they both couldn't see one another, so they thought the other one left. I actually don't want Tonsil's and Spleen's to starve to death or get taken away by pet services again. Let me see if I can get them in here without letting any Sims out. All right, Tonsil's has made it inside, but I think that Spleen's is still asleep. All right, Spleen's, I'm gonna open the door. You need to get in without letting anyone out. Ready? Go. Nice. Spleens is like, you know, it's a sad day when I can't see anything directly in front of me because my eyes are canted at 270 degrees and I can use the bathroom correctly. Someone else just died. Spleens looks so crazy over here. She's like, old people are like a fine wine. You gotta age them and they're delicious. And Spleens is happy that she finally gets to see the sun again. Legit, when I put this down here, do you know who was the very first sim into the bar area? It was Spleens! <laughs> She's like, alcoholism, hell yes! Spleens came in here, she started looking through the different rooms. She's like, what do I spy with my little eye? Is that a full liquor bar? <laughs> it is Spleens. I see Spleens has found the most comfortable area in the entire nightclub. <laughs> my god, it's so comfortable, it's fixed her eyes! Oh, wait, never mind, I was wrong. This is amazing, LSD's making this drink, and Spleens is down there like, we getting a party started! <laughs> Both Spleens and Tonsils have run away. <laughs> oh hell yeah, Spleens is back, y'all. And she's vomiting up a present for everyone. <laughs> and right as she arrived back home, someone just died somewhere. <laughs> Spleens is over here. She's like, Gray, what the hell did you do? Spleens, did you just urinate on that corpse? Spleens is still enjoying drinking everyone's leftovers. Spleens, get people inside. They need to start putting this fire out. I love that the thing that's closest to Ellis right now is Spleens. <laughs> Figure I'd just take a moment to give you all a horrifying Spleens image. Even Spleens is out here by the pool. She looks extra crazy. She's like, yeah, I replaced all the chlorine with cocaine. Okay, Australian man is a legitimate drug or not because Spleens Spleens didn't even get hungry before this happened. In case y'all didn't know, Spleens is a lazy cat. Can you tell? <laughs> she doesn't look lazy. She just looks like she's been hitting the JD for the last 12 hours. Okay, Evan just became friends with Spleens. That's an extra 30 million points for Evan. Poor Spleens is over here. She's like, I gotta use the goddamn bathroom. The bathroom. <laughs> Bad news. Australian man's relationship with LSD is terrible, but his relationship with Spleens is fantastic. <laughs> However, Spleens still loves Australian man the most. <laughs> Don't worry, there's still gonna be hearts exploding and bladder failures. Just, you know, we're actually gonna be able to get the challenge done. You may also notice that Spleens is looking at something very intently. <laughs> when one of her eyes tries to leave her skull, that means it's something important happening. And so if you were ever mentally unstable enough to want this being on a piece of clothing, there is now Spleen's merchandise, which you will find in the YouTube shelf below. I'm gonna try and have plushies coming soon, Spleen's is like, Jesus Christ. No, Spleen's, you don't get a cut of the profits, you just get to watch more of your friends die. She's probably still like, ah, fair trade. I like how Spleen's is so sad, she's like, I'm supposed to be the only woman everyone loves. I always try and think about what Spleens could possibly be dreaming of. She's probably getting raided by the DEA. She's like, no officer, it's not mine. Oh, hey, Autumn is a cat lover. This means that she may live. Spleens is like, that's a wise choice, Autumn. 
I love how Spleens is over here and she's like, this isn't actually a salt water pool. It just tastes salty because of all of the tears. I need to show y'all something. So Spleens is over here and uh, she's asleep. Or is she? I love how Tonsils is over here and he's like, hey Spleens, you having a good time? And Spleens is like, hell yes. Uh, it's good to see that while Australian man and Florida man are taking it easy, both Spleens and Tonsils are working extra hard. Spleens is like, that 30 minutes of sleep was good enough to last me for the next 12 years. Spleens is over here talking to this woman. Spleens is like, you know what I love most about you, ma'am? And she's like, what? And Spleens is like, you're edible. So I frozen them inside of a block of ice that I will shatter with a hammer. It's like a goddamn mattress full of Spleens blood. Spleens is over here. She's like, I smell something. It smells like felonies. Spleens? Spleens, why? Why are you glowing, Spleens? Spleens is over here. She's like, well, I had a stuffed up nose, so, um, yeah, you, you, you get the rest. Okay, now more of Spleens is starting to glow. She's over here. She's like, you ever heard of Bruce Leroy? I've got the glow. Okay, so far, they've gone through about 150 pounds of delicious Spleens flour. No! Spleens! She's being w taken away by a pet care worker, but why? Why would you- why would you take this animal away? Spleens is still radioactive. Well, I guess this turned out to be an excellent narrative on why you should all stay clean. <laughs> How you doing there, Spleens? Spleens is like, loving humans is hard, but eating their plants is easy. As is licking her groin. She's like, don't look at me, it's embarrassing. This is a fantastic pose. This is what I should have put on the merchandise. Florida man, you're supposed to be painting pictures of people hooing, not pictures of Spleens and tonsils. Spleens is over here. She's like, yeah, yeah, it's very sad. Is anyone gonna feed me? Spleens discovered the fire. I guess I'll leave you with this lovely, sad pair voicing their distress at the entirety of what they just saw this week. Spleens is over here. She's like, you know the answer to that. And Spleens is awake. She's over here. She's like, I wouldn't want to miss the lights going out of their eyes. On the plus side, um, the adoption service will take good care of tonsils and spleens. A good loving family will be found for them. And that family will be found dead like two weeks later. I didn't, I didn't make the cats immortal, but I mean, I guess somehow they're still alive. Tonsils is like, due to his poor eyesight, he's like, spleens are still alive? I love how spleens just lays here like this. She doesn't, she doesn't like sleep really with her eyes closed. She just rests with them open, staring, waiting desiring sweet cocaine what what the hell what the hell is this what the hell happened to spleens jesus christ she turned into mr freeze from batman <laughs> i'm not gonna lie spleens looks like she has jaundice right now she's like i've had nothing to eat but sweet powder for the last 12 days i like how she has like 50 different types of illnesses tonsils is totally fine god this is awful i've got like an infection in my spleens sims 4 has come out with eco living and as you can see one half of spleens is like what do i see over there spleens is running away no my god I think that this is actually a new record for Spleens' eye distance. She's like, don't try and stop me. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. No one can stop me. On the plus side, Spleens is back. She's like, you know what? Maybe I don't want to miss any of this. Slowly starving to death. Spleens just straight up went unconscious in the background. Spleens is like a thousand hours. You better take a zero off of that. One of the things that you could grow in the garden is catnip and Spleens is like, I love this shit. Spleens is getting taken away by a pet care worker, but why? They have a cat that is addicted to cocaine. Spleens is hungry. Oh, we can't have that. Spleens is over here. She's like, listen, normally I subsist on you y'all's tears but since no one's crying i'm starving pour out the kitten chow what the hell is that on the forum over here is that like a picture of bootleg spleens the sims recently had a kids room update and that made me realize that we haven't ruined any young lives in quite some time and spleens can only look on in horror because she knows that by the time the day is over some juvenile will be on fire Spleens is over here. She's like, I smell young souls to ruin. How you doing there, Spleens? She's like, oh, fine. Just shit on your front lawn. <laughs> Look at Spleens. She's like, you're my best friend. Because Spleens understands that the best type of cheeseburger is the one that you can go to prison for. I've never seen Colono look more like Spleens in my entire life than right now. It almost appears like his eyes are preparing to jettison out of his head. Spleens came over to the drug house. She's in here and she's like, this place smells delicious. Spleens is looking at all the drug abusers in this house and she's like, it is really sad when
when I have the best teeth here. On the plus side, the drug house does get spleens. Notice uh, where spleens is hanging out? Yeah. Good to see that spleens had a good time last night. LSD came over here to watch some TV with spleens. Died. Ever since spleens discovered TV, she hasn't left the couch. Spleens is um currently vomiting all over the place. And she's standing in her own urine, and Spleens is vomit. While Spleens vomits all over her. <laughs> anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of The Sims. Till next time, stay foxy and much love. Thanks to Spleens' drug habit, we now don't have much money in order to build a house. And so I am going to build a house that is one square by one square. And Spleens can mostly have dreams where she wishes she was dead. How you doing there, Spleens? She's like, everywhere I go, I see death. Poor Spleens. She's like, I went up to that room with 70 people and I have tuberculosis now. If anyone needed more proof that Spleens is a saintly being, she is walking on water. Like legit, she's walking on water. Look. Well, what happens if you put 100 sims inside of a one-by-one one house? Right over here, you can see that Spleens spies something with her little eye. Do you know what it is? Agony. Okay, what's really funny is Spleens is getting taken away by a pet care worker. I don't understand why she's- no, Oh my god! god. I was gonna say she's fine. She's just feasting on this bowl of peas over here. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Run, Spleens! Don't let them take you from me! Everyone, including Spleens the cat, understands that typically there is only one survivor in this type of challenge. And so the further behind in the pack you are, the more potential you have to eventually drown to death. Spleens is over here. She's like a moment of silence for Australian man. But not too long, because he smells like ass. <laughs> Who the hell? Who the hell are you? He's probably just a concerned citizen. He walked over. He's like, "Hey, man, your cat doesn't look so good. It says that she's sleeping, but it actually looks like she's tripping." Look, man, this is Spleens. She's always that way. It says Spleens needs you. I always love it when Spleens goes radioactive. She's like, "There's nothing I love more than turning into Doctor Manhattan." It said Spleens is hungry. What does she want? Plutonium? Oh, hey, Spleens, you finally stopped going radioactive. That's good. Oh no. My spleens is leaking. <laughs> Are you okay? Tonsils is obviously very concerned. Anyway, folks, I'm gonna leave you with this gratuitous spleens shot. The other thing is, I've never actually forced my sims to live this long. I don't know if they can physically do it. Apparently, tonsils over here is saying no to spleens. I may have to kill him. But you should say yes to spleens. As a matter of fact, in a little bit, I'll be telling you exactly how you can own your own spleens the cat. Ever wanted a cocainico? Well, now you can have it. More on that later. Yeah, I'm coming. Oh, fuck me. So I get asked for this all the time. I have partnered up with Makeship in order to create the very first custom Spleens plush. It does not come with the flower. Of course it's flower. Come on, guys. They did an incredible job. It, it has a bell, the bow, the eyes, the fantastic tail, her 240 degree vision, the ears. We're offering this right now, starting today, August 28th, 2020. If you want your own, you've got to follow the link in the description. You can order it from the website. You can finally adopt your own spleens today. I like that Colino has already made one single friend. Spleens the cat. I love how she's just like the gatekeeper. She's like, yep, all right, let me see your ticket. Okay, good, yep, head on in, uh-huh. All right, another dead piece of young flesh to add to the pile of failure. Excellent, yep, very good. Spleens, buddy, are, are you, are you? Spleens just teleported away from my line of sight. I was gonna say, is she unable to get down the ladder? <laughs> I'm glad you're happy, Spleens. Pizus, an Australian man, sadly did not make it. Spleens and tonsils are still fine, though. Spleens has gone into labor. How? What the hell have you been doing up here? I always love seeing what sort of unholy being Spleens gives birth to. Congratulations, Spleens has given birth to a kitten. I'm not gonna lie, Blue Cheese has his mother's eyes. <laughs> Spleens, what in the hell did you give birth to? Oh, it is awful. But I mean, Spleens loves her. Tonsils is like, Spleens, did your head lose weight? Don't you touch my Spleens, I'll cut you. 